everybody. Sorry, I meant to come in like 25 seconds ago and completely got distracted with the game. Uh, <laughs> yeah, hi everybody. Welcome back. Um, I hope you all are doing well and have had a good weekend and are looking forward to a good week ahead of you. Um, before we get properly started, I just want to take a second and talk about this little, you can see it right here. My hand is over top of it. Um, let me full screen her for y'all. Um, that doesn't help. Well, it's Yvonne. It's Yvonne is what it is. Uh, Yvonne B is doing a streamathon, trying to raise money to help her, uh, fix her computer um this is at the time of june 3rd 2024 um she's streaming the whole week trying to reach a goal uh she's already technically reached her first goal um and had to double it which really shocked the hell out of her and all of that but um yeah uh repair-a-thon for her computer parts and stuff I'm trying to be a good friend and support her and help her out as much as I can because I can't help her financially. Um, but uh, yeah, I just want to quickly shout her out. So please feel free to check her out. Uh, she is for the chat on screen. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Yvonne B. Um, it's, you know, she she's one of my closest friends and is in in real life uh off the internet uh and i try to help her out as much as i can i give her the hardest time i fucking can too but like i do try to help her out when as much as i can but anyway um speaking of helping people out <laughs> i also have a way that you can help me out <laughs> if you so choose uh patreon.com slash crimson night that helps me make my content and my channel better um it gives uh yeah it's a it's stuff uh there's also link tree where you can support me through the social medias the discords uh twitch youtube etc actually if you're watching this on youtube please like and subscribe and help me out with the algorithm and all that type of stuff um if not that's okay if you don't want to do any of that that's okay i won't hold it i, I won't hold it against you None of it is like paywall type anything, you know, it, it's just if you feel if you are financially able and willing to. Now, another option if you are financially willing is you could uh, look into donating money for uh, what's going on with Palestine and all of that, but um i haven't talked about it before or much because uh i'm trying to keep my uh content separate from my personal uh at least as much as i can um well <sighs> complicated um <clears throat> I'm basing it off of how some of some YouTubers that I greatly respect uh, have been handling it. Like they're all about, like they're talking all about Palestine and stuff in their personal socials, um, but they leave it off of their YouTube channel, type of a thing. Um, but I felt like I couldn't bring it up with that. I, I could, I felt like I couldn't, you know, bring up Yvonne, for example. Uh, without also being like, or if you would rather, you know, not help out to streamers, you could just Palestine stuff. Um, Yuval, uh, Yuval the Terrible on TikTok uh, does a lot of uh, stuff involving uh, relocating families from the danger areas and keeping them, getting them safe and stuff. So it, you could find him on TikTok and find his links and stuff if you want. Um, I don't have anything prepared. This was just off the top of my head. So I apologize for that. But um, anyway, anyway, and, and enough rambling. Let's just get back into the game. Um, 
we're pretty close to being done with the game for the record um the uh pretty damn close uh we only have about like nine we're we're at like 92 percent i think i'll see it here in a second 95 percent uh before we get properly started here just a brief thing i finally got that last perk so we have all the perks done all the secrets of london evie's notebook not 100 percent yet dreadful crimes still have some out there world war one is 100 percent conquest activities are 100 percent and down here, progress tracker. We are here in the game. Uh, we have all of our associate activities done. We have, basically if it's golden, it's done. We have one dreadful crime left, as well as this memory chain here for uh, Duleep, Duleep Singh. And this, I don't remember what this is, but uh, we have that left. Um, I can't click on it yet. Oh, oh, no, I do remember what that is, actually. Uh, we can't, I don't think we can unlock that until we actually complete the story. But, anyway. So, yeah. Alright, the plan. The plan. Um, I also went around and collected all the royal correspondence. Um, so, what I'll do is I'll just throw this up, and if you want to read it, you can pause. So yeah, I'm just gonna... Oops, I think I'm probably scrolling too quick. I'm just gonna... Go through these... If you need to pause, you can. Go for it. Um, I mean, I'm sure they're also available online on the Assassin's Creed wiki. Because uh, they have, like, everything on there. Um, but... I think this is the last one. Come on. Come on. Stop. Again, sorry, scrolling too fast. That's the last one. All right. So if you want to read those, you can. Um, it's slower for me to read them out loud, so that's why I didn't. Um, all right, let's get started here. So the plan. Um, dreadful crime. Oh, right, right over here. I'm going to hit the dreadful crime first. 
Um, and then we'll hit uh, do the Sing's memories. And then we'll progress the storyline as needed from that point. Yeah, I don't care. She's in my sights! <laughs> Freddy! Good old Freddy! How you doing, mate? There has been a murder at the palace. I need you to be oh, no. careful with this one. Anti-royalist pamphlets have been cropping up and tensions are high. The Queen is very nervous about security. This way. Oops, sorry, Freddy. I didn't mean to slam into you like that. Oh shit, there's a whole soiree happening. See all those people? Good old Aberline. I mean, of course, a cab, but. <laughs> this way. Aberline, you jog so slowly. Here we are. Good luck. Thank you. Mm. Okay. A member of the palace guard slumped in a, in a contorted position. Eyes and mouth wide open. The body shows no signs of violence. Guardsman. No bot no wounds. Okay. Ooh, what is this? A safe. Vault. Marked by deep gashes as if someone attempted to break in. I should go back and ask about this. Please Mom? leave the room for a moment. No one is permitted to see me open the safe. A priceless face lying broken on the ground, signs of a struggle. Sorry, give me a moment, Your Majesty. I'm just, uh, let me finish my inspection. He's thus. List of eminent invitees to the investiture to be held this evening. The Queen will knight several industrialist to oppose child labor. I should labor. go back and ask about this. Yeah, we'll, we'll get to that. Um, I don't want to leave the room yet. I don't want to do anything that she would view as leaving the room. Broken window. Window is broken. The broken area is large enough to allow access to someone. So they came in through the window, probably. Letter from Scotland Yard to Her Majesty's Private Secretary, Sir Henry Pons Ponsonby. Dear Sir Henry, I am troubled to have, write, have to write concerning a disturbing situation that was recently dis uh, had, that has has recently occurred. Yesterday, we were informed that a young boy had been abducted, and we have rushed to bring this to your attention and through you to the attention of Her Majesty. 
as you think necessary, for we fear the boy's appearance may be connected to a possible attempt. I lost my spot. A possible attempt to disrupt this evening's investiture ceremony at the palace. Please be assured, Sir Henry, that we are doing everything possible to locate the child. One Arthur Doyle. Doyle's address is appended. So our friend young Artie is missing. All right, let's talk to you. Can we talk to you, Majesty? No? I don't want to do that again. All right, well, I can't talk to her at the moment, so I'm just gonna... Imagine that someone was after the scepter. I must see it. I ordered the scepter with the dove to be brought from the tower for tonight's event. <gasps> Thank heavens! It is untouched. Can you tell me about the body? Poor man. I arrived to find him here, dead as you see him. He gave his life to defend my person. What about the event This tonight? evening, I will knight several industrialists that have worked to end the practice of child labor. All of London's luminaries are invited. And what about the vault? Only I know the combination. The vault contains the very precious scepter with the dove, which I've chosen to be used in tonight's knighthood ceremony. Hmm. Okay, thank you for your answers. Six out of six and one suspect met. Break an attempt, but unsuccessful. I wonder if someone could tell me more about this. Uh, I'm gonna... Okay, it won't let me. Fine. Anything out here on the balcony? Probably not. Nope. Okay. Alright, off to Artie's. I shall check on one Arthur Conan Doyle in a moment. Uh, I'll be back later. Freddy? Fredward? There you are, sir. I'll be back. Be sure that nobody attempts anything here. I'll be back. Have yourself. Don't get naughty with the queen. We're watching you, Freddy. All right. Now, where is Artie's yard? Artie's yardy. Okay, so it's over that way, which points me over here. There it is. Okay. Alright. I apparently can't fast travel. Fine. Unfortunate. And maybe just not from my location. Pardon me. Don't mind me. Just taking the fastest, most direct route. Fast travel? No fast travel. Okay. All right. Cart it is. Hey, fellas. Thanks for bringing the car around. What's that over there? Come on. Load up. Load up. Load up. Oh god, run!
Cheese it, lads. Oh, those are trees. Why are you? Here now. Sus. Oh, do I have to go through here? Fine. All right, lads, here's the plan. I'm going to park up the street around the corner, and I want you Slowly. to stay with the car. Okay? That's right. I will return. Wait with the car. <clears throat> oh, uh, pit stop. There we go. If you need anything else, you know where to find me. All right. Artis yardies. Uh, what happened here? Tell me about Artis. He said he was onto something. Said everything added in clues. Okay. Tell me about Mr. Henry I Raymond. I did see Artie's friend, Mr. Raymond. He'd just come from Perlock Publishing with his new Penny Dreadful. Seemed very excited about it. I didn't like him much. Okay. You didn't like him. You don't want to expound on that. Okay. Let me talk to you, sir. Young friend. Young master buck. Artie's been all in a state. Thinks there's some sort of master criminal on the <clears> street. <throat> then this morning, he's gone. A master criminal, you say? Might one be a uh, young Moriarty? Oh, Dooley was falsely accused in our first mystery. Dooley's brother. All right, what we got here? Artie's yard, blank paper, a sheet of apparently blank notebook paper. Hmm. Evidence wall, drawings and texts linking various clues and anomalies throughout the mysteries that have been solved and resulting in penny dreadfuls. The final scrawled message is unfinished, leading to Ramo. I should go back and ask about this. What about the Come evidence to think of it, he had been going on about the Queen and all for the last day or two. Seemed to think she was in some sort of trouble. The Queen? Hmm. And what do you have to say, young friend? You know, when he thought something was important, he'd write it up in invisible ink. Lemon juice like. He'd use smoke to read it. If you have a way to make smoke, you can see what it says. Way to make smoke. Smoke bomb would do it. Written in, <clears throat> written in invisible ink. Perlock Publishing, Henry Raymond. It's all connected. Follow the clues. Okay. Now. The Perlock Publishing. Ah, oh, kids, don't get in trouble. Oh my god, Evie. Down. 
Actually, I don't need to pick up the car, do I? Uh, I might pick up the boys. Yeah, it's just around the corner. I ain't going far, guys. Perlock the printers. Perlock publishing. Okay. Hello. Hello. What is this? Do we have no nobody to talk to? Nobody home? Okay. I'm just gonna be snooping around. Not breaking and entering, the door was open. Dynamite crates? Empty munition crates. Clearly marked Prescott Munitions number 408. Uh-oh. The a little urgency in the step. Publishing map, a plan of Buckingham Palace. The Queen's study is circled in black. Uh oh. Still missing a couple of clues. Ah, that's right, there's a full floor. We've been in this kind of building before. Let's check papers on the table. Perlock Publishing, anti-royalist pamphlets, down with the monarchy, an end to our suffering under Victoria. The queen must pay for her sins. I mean, yes, but murder's a bit much. Abolish the monarchy in other ways. I mean, like, not just, well, okay. Murder is not a bit much. Ex Exploding a fucking palace is a bit much. Perlock Publishing. Galley proof. A typesetter's galley proof for a pre penny dreadful. Explosion at the palace. With some descriptive text. Attack at the heart of Britain, Buckingham Palace. In flames will the queen escape. The book is written by Henry Raymond. An explosion at Buckingham Palace. I must warn them. All right, fellas. We gotta get. We gotta cheese it back to the castle, the palace, whatever. This way. Come on, lads. Lads, lads, lads. I wish they could have brought the, the, thing. Fine. Get in, get in, get in, get in. One, two, three, uno mas. Four. Out of go. Technically, this takes place after the main storyline. Technically, this all takes place after the main storyline of the game. Because the queen acts as if she knows the prize, and if I remember correctly, she... Spoilers. She meets the prize in the final segment of the game. So... Yeah. So it's very much this thing of I'm 
uh, technically this is after what uh, the completion of the game. Also with me, lads. Oh, sorry. Made those horses kiss. It's fine. people here for the knighthood ceremony. The queen will use the scepter with the dove for the knighting. She'll arrive precisely at one o'clock. Wait for me. You said. Everyone must leave! Do as you're told. Out later, get your ass going. There may be an explosion. There may be an explosion. I've saved them. Nothing is happening. No explosion. What is this? I've been tricked. Raymond, why has he done this? <coughs> you are more naive than you appear. Look beyond the obvious, beyond surface appearances. Why should we evacuate? He says to look, look beyond, beyond the, the obvious. obvious, beyond surface appearances. I mean, it would. It would. Causing the palace to evacuate would make things look like the royals don't have control. It would make them look bad. Ah, uh, yes, the magician. Nothing but a showman. So many people makes everything more dramatic. Mm hmm. Henry Raymond, stalwart citizen. I found the same clues you found. I knew there was to be an explosion and I led you here to save everyone. I'm as mystified as you are that nothing happened. No. No. What about you, sir? 
Henry Raymond, the terrorist. You've helped me herd all those dreary people to certain death. We shall hear the explosion presently. No. Diversion. Criminal mastermind. Seems to me you've created the perfect diversion, haven't you? That's the one. Quite right. Scattered papers. I always get what I want. Written by a left-handed man. This is the one where like 45 people killed him. I brought him his invitation to the knighthood ceremony. <clears throat> the one with the special scepter. steal the scepter? I mean, he did try to break into the vault, but... The will be used... It will use the storied scepter with the dove to ignite an industrialist. Again, back here. Never Good trust man. a man who tells you what you want to hear. He is after something. Mm -hmm. Kidnapper wants to abscond with the queen. Probably not. Killed the queen. Maybe. Not likely. Stole the scepter with the dove, probably. And used the chaos as a, uh... Here's my theory, as of this moment. He... made a big scene about trying to break into the safe. Only the queen could open it. He hid somewhere and play and play, hid somewhere where he could see the the combination, and she put it in while he was hidden and watching. That's what I think happened. And the rest of this is just a diversion to to cover his escape. <laughs> while you were chasing all those people around, I absconded with the queen. A hefty ransom is now due. No, no, they wouldn't pay. They wouldn't pay, or if they did, they they're more they're more likely to kill you, my guy. I needed you to distract everyone so that I could quietly assassinate Her Majesty the Queen. I mean it's possible, but it's a bit too obvious. A man like me can take anything he wants. Even the Queen's most beloved item of all her crown jewels. <clears throat> The priceless and symbolic scepter with the dove. This one. The scepter with the dove taken with your help. What could better display my genius? Okay.
How was it? No done? one questions you when you wear a uniform. Yeah, he was the supposedly dead man and the, the supposedly dead guard. I bet. And watched her. Just sat there and watched her. Yeah, that spider that puts him to sleep instead of like a near death comatose sleep state. I suspect the solution will turn on geometry. Safe cracker, such sensitive hands. I am a fellow of many skills. Cracking a safe is but one. I mean, maybe, but no, that doesn't seem like his style. Coercion. I threatened the queen with her very life. She told me the combination in a thrice. No. Would never have happened. I simply watched the queen open the safe when you arrived. Yep, that's the one. Come on. Quite right. This is an outrage. I can't believe it. How can you do such a thing to people? The dead guard was I. The spider venom allowed me to fake my death. I had a perfect view from where I lay. Mm -hmm. I have mm -hmm. stolen the Queen's most prized possession, the scepter with the dove. Think of it. I have outfoxed you, the most cunning detective in Britain. I mocked you by leaving clues for you at every turning point. Now I have the scepter, proof positive of my superiority. There's no way that scepter fit in that wall safe by the way there's no way unless it can be broken down into pieces evie wake up it's raymond he's taken artie hostage they're no. on the roof jacob's here to help you evie I suppose this means our detective days are over. But what about you, Artie? <clears throat> I'm glad I survived Mr. Raymond's insanity, but sadly he won't be here anymore to write more books. A great loss, I'm sure. I'm quite serious, Miss Evie. Me and my friends waited every week to read the next number and find out what happened next. Why don't you write some yourself? The fellow would have to be very clever indeed. Sounds like you'd be in your element, my dear. The gruesome Whitechapel murders by Artie. I should think I would use my full name, by Artie Conan Doyle. But he's Arthur. Sounds more of a serious fella. There we go.
I mean, this dove cane sword. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's swish, ain't it? Look at that. Come on. Hey, guys, fight me. That, that's not fighting me. Somebody fight me. Here we go. Look at that. Fancy. Yes, am I anonymous? Yes. White. Okay. Go ahead and upgrade. It's identical in love gold, hate subtlety. <laughs> No, I think I like the design of the world's greatest cane sword better. The red. Get an empty beer bottle. I'm only no sorry enough. it wasn't me who've done you. There must be something. All right. Um. Do 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 do. Alright, to the memories. That's it, girl. To the memories. Happy memories. Crazy memories. Calm thy memories. Do, 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 do. That was a bit of fun, you know, much better than how the uh, Arno mis murder mysteries ended. It's just because I keep getting a little too close to the wall. I love it. asks Jacob and Evie to meet him at a garden party held at Buckingham Palace Gardens. When the assassins arrive at the party, Henry and Duleep Singh, the last of the Indian Maharajas, argue about the lack of commitment of Duleep to the people of India. Your attempts to influence Parliament for the Indian cause have failed. You must do more. I will not jeopardize my relationship with queen and country to satisfy your crusade. Your Highness, you belong to India, not here acting the part of a noble foreigner. I have wasted enough time indulging in this if nonsense. your mother could see you now, the last Maharaja of Punjab, basking inside his golden cage. How dare you? I always recommend bringing someone's mother into the argument. Fair, po fair point. If he doesn't help his people, he will regret it forever. How may we help? Will you talk to him? He won't listen to me. We'll do our best. Hey, 
tell you it's a bloody great duck shoot out there. I've been breaking it in for years. You should come out, you old bugger. It's very tempting. I'm just not sure I can stomach the action scene. All the spice. Your Highness, you have guests. I suppose Mr. Green sent you. Bringing up your mother was... Impolite, and he was wrong to do so. We'd like to rectify the situation. Then humor me, and join me in a shooting game. None of these people have any sense of enjoyment, and I am bored to death. A shooting game? Seeing you haven't changed at all. Ellsworth? My word! <laughs> How good it is to see you! The mother country has treated you well. <laughs> uh, Jacob and Evie Fry, this is Brinley Ellsworth, a friend from a past life. You've made new friends, I see. What brings you to this part of the Empire? Ah, company business, unfortunately. But I could not resist the chance of seeing you again. It's been far too long. I've heard nobody throws a party better than my dearest friend. <laughs> I'm eager to see if your reputation overseas holds any truth. My servant, Thomas, will be scoring the game. <clears throat> Acquire the most amount of points by shooting the bottles in front of you. Each bottle is worth one point. You have 30 seconds. May the best shot win. Start the timer. Nine points. Come, Thomas. This isn't enough of a challenge. Let's shorten the timer. Oh. Round two will now commence. Try and do as well, if not better, within a 20 second time limit. Timer at the ready. Begin. I do believe you are equally matched with this one, Sing. Your turn, Your Highness. Come, let us see if you are better with a gun than you were with a slingshot. <laughs> Allow me. Impressive. I am in war, Sing. What they say of you is true. Damn. Yeah. Sir, I believe I heard a second shot. He's right. That sounded like a second gunshot. Strange. Let me see what I can find out. I'm sure it wasn't anything serious. Don't bother. No, no, it's serious. All right. Oh, I love that. Okay. I've been doing this a long time. I know the difference hey, between Rose. one shot and two. There were most definitely two shots. <sighs> Are you suggesting this is a serious matter? It was most likely just an echo. Leave it to <laughs> Excuse me. A second shot? <laughs> I didn't hear anything. There was no one else <laughs> who would shoot a gun at a party. Oh, indeed, rich people. His friends, his servant, the best shooter, the beat. Right, impacted at the stump. From what we saw. Oh no. We continue the line following the line path. 
there's something over here. Second shot. Here we go. Handgun, it's barrel is hot. Shooter footprints, shooter footprints. Let's check with the lady first. I saw the man in front of me with a gun. I just assumed it was part of the decor. You know how royalty likes to socialize. Of course, yes, socialize. <laughs> you, however, my friend, are suspicious as fuck. What are you on about? Guns are prohibited in the gardens. That prince is causing problems. <clears throat> he deserves to be silenced. Kill him! You too! Clothing patch of the British India Com Company. Mm -hmm. In his pocket, a Templar ring. The Templar seal. What are they up to now? You're still here? Of course I'm still here. About that second shot. It was nothing, Miss Fry. Now, I must return to the party. Yes, do fill me in on your life here. It's been far too long. Of course. Apologies, Your Highness. Henry, we have a problem. Henry will want to hear of this. <laughs> Henry, we have a problem. Any progress? We've got a problem. We aren't the only ones seeking him out. Don't tell me the British Indies companies are harassing him again. They can't afford it. Worse, they're not acting alone. And Mr. Singh wants to be left out of it. The Templars? It can't be. We have to convince him to act quickly, or he'll be in deeper waters than he already is. Oh, meet me back at my old shop. I might know something that can help. Alright, he wants to, us to meet him back at his old shop. That is up here in Whitechapel. We're going to Whitechapel and we're gonna meet Henry. Going to Whitechapel and we're gonna meet Henry. <coughs> going to Whitechapel and she's wearing white too. I'm a mess. Ooh, to the chapel and we're gonna meet Henry. Ooh, to the chapel and we're gonna meet Henry. Ooh, to the chapel and we're gonna meet Henry. Ooh, to my chapel and we're gonna meet okay i'll stop i'll stop i promise Ooh, pop, pop, pop. i'm going the wrong way aren't i Excuse me. Da 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 
Da -da 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 -da. There's no excuse for me. <clears throat> I mean, no. But you could try. Make Duleep understand how important he is for India's future. Henry asks the assassins to prove Duleep has been muted by certain persons. To do so, Jacob and Evie need to recover Duleep's stolen letters and give them back. Not today, no brain juices. Fair. Good, you're here. Yes, I'm here. Now what? Oh, drive. Okay. This isn't the first time His Highness has That's had it. troubles with the British Indies Company. A couple of years ago, they held his mother captive and blocked all his letters to her. Odds are they're keeping his correspondence from reaching the outside world once again. I have acquired a mail courier schedule. There are two separate routes of transport. The first, a mail carrying carriage convoy. The second, a train. If we set up an ambush, we should be able to seize his letters. Maybe this will change his mind. Start with the convoy. We must block the road. There you are. The male convoy will be here any minute now. Scout the area for allies. I will guard the area. near the convoy's ambush location. Four. I'm in three. Okay, game. That was rude. I recruited three within the area, and they counted only two of them. Rude. Thank you. 
Good, you're here. This isn't the first time His Highness has had troubles with the British Indies Company. A couple of years ago, they held his mother captive and blocked all his letters to her. Odds are they're keeping his correspondence from reaching the outside yeah, world know. once again. I have acquired the mail carrier schedule. There are two separate routes of transport. The first, a mail carrying carriage convoy. The second, a train. If we set up an ambush, you should be able to seize his letters. Maybe this will change his mind. Start with the convoy. We must block the road. The male convoy will be here any minute now. Scout the area for allies. I will guard the area. We've got dynamite planted near the convoy's ambush location. triggering at all so there we go sure it's not counting it but sure the convoy is headed our way it counted it i'll take it understood will do got it Some letters. I didn't mess up, did I? Henry will want these. Repeat the same process with the train. I must return to my shop and shall invite Mr. Singh over for a spot of tea. Okay. I knew it. The game broke my controls, so I had to reload. That sucks. Hopefully reloading doesn't put me too far back. Okay. I still can't. Okay, fine. Guess I'll do it by foot.
reinforcements. Which is set. Those letters should be inside the train. The train's Understood. coming. Got it. Exactly that fast. Henry was right. I should show him what I found. There is a difference between pacifism and inaction. How many times do I have to tell you? You two do have <clears throat> impeccable timing. Did we interrupt something? I believe these will be of interest to you, Your Highness. These letters, they are from me. The seals have been broken. That's how we found them. This, this is a letter I wrote to my mother when I was just a boy. Where did you find these possessions of mine? On a mail convoy. The Templars. They have a way of getting to you. I thought I had put an end to it years ago. But the British Indies Company continues to steal my property. You were right to think something strange was afoot. We must take action. But it will not be possible without your help. I believe you're right. But I must have some time to think on this. In the meantime, please be discreet. I don't need Her Majesty finding out about this. Right. 
Got him. Duluth discovers there is a plan in motion to donate stolen Indian Punjabi riches to the British Indian Company's uh, organization. This transaction must be stopped. The Indian riches shall return to India. Good to see you again. The pleasure is mine. Shall we? It has come to my attention that the British Indies Company has stolen a large sum of wealth from the good people of Punjab. It is my intention to send it back. And where is this gold located? All I've managed to find out is that the BIC have their very own accountant. Perhaps he will have more information about this. Good plan. Apparently, he likes to frequent a certain pub. Okay. Let me stop by the store over here. Oh, I can't sprint. Okay. Game by oh, it's because you're following me. Okay. The accountant should be here somewhere. King of Denmark. Hello, sir. Apologies, but I don't hang around with that sort. Ah, it's a racism. Oh, you just missed him. He headed to the bank with a couple of men I'd never seen before. Which is odd, because the bank isn't even open now that I think of it. He's right. We should go to the bank. Going to the bank right now and wait. In on a prince or Maharaj is actually king. But okay. There you go. Faster! Easy. Easy. We have to find another way in. I will secure a safe route before following you inside. Get in first. I'll join you later. All right. I'm going to Batman my way in. Down in the vault. Hello, sir. The accountant should be near. Perhaps I should check the vaults. Oh. I'm just gonna pop in here. The longer you make me search, the worse it will be for you. There you are. Oh, shoot. Hi. No. I will not kill you. Even though, you know, they can. Oh, 
You two are going to be having a sn uh, snuggle. It's fine. Just chill. Pick the lock. Just go shooting your mouth off at any opportunity. Do you have any idea who you're working for? The BIC accounts are confidential. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just let me go and I'll be quiet. I promise you. Not a chance. We'll take them out together, but we've got to do so quietly. You take Dude, one. You're a I'll take the other. Ready? I am indebted to you. The British Indies thugs have somewhat worked him over. We need to get him to safety. There's someone intruding on our affairs. Find them and kill them. Find them and kill them. We must bring the accountant with us. Parking on it. Him here. Let's get out of here. Thank you both. I, I would have died back there. What can I do to repay you? We need to know you could shut up. Company wants with the stolen Punjabi gold. Don't go this way. Don't that go this I way. Do don't go this know. way. What I can tell you is that they've taken it to a warehouse in Southern. Whatever they want with it, it can't be good. You don't hold people hostage when there's good news on the line. Set you down here, sir. Don't don't say anything or go anywhere. Oh, oh, oh. Pick this guy up because his health is slowly bleeding out. Oh god, this isn't even a way out. Fuck me. Oh, so much for that. Reload. Gotta clear some shit. I 
don't know how that worked, but it worked. you out of here thank you both i i would have died back there what can i do to yes. repay you we need to know Shut what up. the british indies company wants with the stolen punjabi gold that i do not know what i can tell you is that they've taken it to a warehouse in southwark whatever they want with it it can't be good you don't hold people hostage when there's good news on the line fair second that I can oh that's a good thing I missed because those guys almost never go down in one shot turn around don't turn around don't turn around die you move sir Off the geometry, lady. Fuck. Okay, watch out. Yeah, I believe one more guy. I don't know where he went. Okay. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, don't worry. Okay, I'm not seeing any reds, so we should be clear. Put him in the back. I will take him to the hospital. Huh? Oh, Help. Please, don't leave me here. We shall reconvene later. Thank you, Miss Fry. Hospital. At the hospital. <clears throat> oh, just one second. I need to check something. If I unmute Yvonne, <laughs> yes, she um, will come through. Okay. All righty. Sorry, I have her over here so that I can actually keep an eye on her. All right. Yay.
Okay. Upon discovering the location of the stolen gold, delete them, the assassins go on a mission. I discovered more information on our stolen gold. To my carriage. Okay, where are we going? It's all quite strange. The British Indies Company working with the Templar Order. And for what? Perhaps we will never know. The account had revealed they're hiding a shipment of gold, previously stolen from India, in a carriage at an old Staric warehouse. We must find this carriage and steal it from them. And what of you? Why, I'm here to help you, of course. They don't call me the fourth best shot in London for nothing. The gold must be found. Go on. Easy, girl. This is it. The gold is here somewhere. Return to me once you found it, and I'll stay behind and keep an eye on the trouble. Okay. This is where the gold is located. The Templars are not far away, and we must lose them. I'll keep the wolves at bay. Your Highness... Hurry! Go! I must get rid of these pursuers. Wait a second. I failed the thing. Loot the gold from the Templar thief. I didn't... This is probably too late. I probably have to restart the whole thing. Gold from the Templar thief. Yep, okay. Yes, yes, we get it. He's a good shot. <laughs> I didn't do the epic it did before, but that's okay. Uh, restart memory. Templar Thief. Apparently I didn't do enough search. Enough searching before I decided to just act. Okay. Oh. Mm. 
be watch out for information on our stolen gold. To my carriage. There you go. It's all quite strange. The British Indies Company working with the Templar. And for what? Perhaps we will never know. The account had revealed they're hiding a ship of gold, previously stolen from India in a carriage at an old Staric warehouse. We must find this carriage and steal it from them. And what of you? Why, I'm here to help you, of course. They don't That's call it. me the fourth best shot in London for nothing. The gold must be found. This is it. The gold is here somewhere. Return to me once you've found it, and I'll stay behind and keep an eye out for trouble. Be careful. What they think is theirs, they won't easily part with. This is where the gold is located. The Templars are not far away, and we must use them. I'll keep the walls at bay. Your Highness. Hurry, go! I must get rid of these pursuers. Oops. I 
shot a horse. I shot a horse and I hated it. <laughs> Cute guard. God, bullets are universal across every gun. We lost them. Good work. You were quite impressive out there, if I may say. Well, you're too kind. It was rather <coughs> exhilarating, if I'm being honest. Now, I've hired a captain to escort the gold overseas. If you would kindly fetch the crate from the back. Ah! I love that this guy was sitting inside the whole time going, did they not see me in here? <laughs> you can't get away that easily, thief! Are you quite all right? You had me frightened. I'm all right. Really. I commend you for fighting the mob. Really? With you at my side, it will be an almost simple task to send this gold back to where it belongs. Why don't you walk off that last fight and come back to me when you're ready for the next leg of the journey? There's still work sure. to be done. I, again, I love that the whole time that guard, that guy, the Templar was sitting in there going, do they not see me in here? <laughs> do, what, am, am I here? <laughs> am I invisible? <laughs> I've been here. That guy came out that door like he was Sam Rice from fucking Game Changer. I've been here the whole time. Oh man, I need to. I need to repair my inventory. No, refill my inventory. Thanks for your business. He was singing, don't be suspicious. Absolutely. Don't be suspicious. Don't Where be we? suspicious. We must return this gold to its people. My people. I procured us a captain to transport it to its destination. But our next feat will be to get it out of London. And we must protect it. Precisely. Now, if you would be so good as to bring the gold aboard, we can get going. Okay, where is the gold? Guys, you're in my way. Ladies, don't drop the gold, my... Kills 
snipers in close combat. Okay, I can try. Going to leaving from London and we're going to India. I knew we wouldn't get far without another appearance from them. Look out! Stand okay. back! No, we're in this together. It's okay, there's a billion others like her. They all have the same face. We'll take it. And totally not that Ubisoft just reused the same facial features. Totally not. Nurse Joy, absolutely. Nurse Joy and Officer... Jenny. That follow me and subscribe to me. You're just the only one that's here right now. <laughs> Crush the boob. You're the you're the undead rose, because you're the one who comes back. Who's a phoenix? I'm going to be restarting the mission, so... I'm restarting the mission because I defeated them all in melee and it says I didn't. It's lying to me. We? we must return this gold to its people. My okay. I procured us a captain to transport <laughs> <it> to <laughs> <destination>. <laughs> <laughs> and we must protect it. Precisely. Well, honey, now, if you be so good as to bring the gold aboard, we can get going. Kitty. 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 Sorry, I need my hand. If only you liked being picked up and cuddled. Does he like being picked up and cuddled? Right? 
Zombie roads, zombie roads. Just the same as the rosy roads. I knew we wouldn't get far without another appearance from them. Look out! Stand back! No, we're in this together. Be one. Did I? Yes, one. Okay. Two. Go. There you go. Evie. Just the same as a rosy rose. I had seven. I had seven. Oh wait, no, it's on the right first. I mean, I stab seven, but only get. I knew we wouldn't eight. get far without another. Yes, 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 like yes. Look out! Stand back! No, we're in this together. Swear to God. Three. Four. Five. 
Dick. Seven. There we go. can't see it, but it's loading. It's got a loading. Here, I'll hide it. I can't hide it. It would, it would be... Come on. Game. Hold on, I'm killing the game. OBS crashed. Fucking hell. First, the game froze. And when I went to take care of that, the game crashed. I mean, not the game crashed. OBS crashed. Took my, and took way too long coming back up, meaning that it is going to be a pain in my ass with the VOD. Okay. Bring the game back up. I I didn't. That was everything else on on outside of my control.
I want to be five. What we're going to do is we are going to move you to this. And then... Okay. Oh, wait, there is one thing I need to do. Hold on. Okay, now let's try this again. I want to scream. This is what it's been doing. Just this spinny, loady thing. That's what it's been doing. I want to scream. Oh! Is it gonna put me right back? Come on. Come on. <sighs> Ubisoft, fix your damn game. I know it's uh, no, it's years old at this point. But fix your damn game.
Come on. Stupid game. Come on. Not even in there long enough for me to open the damn menu when I'm spamming the escape button. Ah! Okay. I'm gonna Google this. I know what it's gonna say. Because it's the same thing that happens elsewhere. Uh... Okay. So, yes, it says exactly what I expected it to say. Uh, it's the exact same bug that pops up occasionally. There is no fix for it. You just kind of have to hope it ha it fixes itself. Ugh. Okay. Fortunate thing is we now have to do this all over again. Could be worse. It could be worse. I knew we wouldn't get far without another appearance. Yes, then. skip the cutscene part. Dude went to orbit. Come on. There you go. Two. God, I hate how fucking slow it takes to count the damn kill. Brad. Girl. I swear to God. Do what I am telling you to do, and I know you can do. Okay, now let's wait for the boat to catch up a bit. Three. Guy gets launched into orbit. Count it. Five. Count it. No. No. Come on, boat. Catch the fuck up. Stopped. Why are you fucking stopped? we go. God 
Damn. Work, please. Sink him! Don't Fucking let him get hell. away with that cargo! What the hell to throw? Making progress once again. Let's fuck her over here. We must escort this boat to the next dock where we may disembark. And then this vessel will be clear of enemy waters. We've done some good today. I can feel it. I'm glad you feel that way, Your Highness. We're not finished yet. Guild Templar is undetected. Okay.
They weren't counting me under the, the undetected stuff, even though I wasn't the one killing them. Stupid. The de game's definition of undetected is stupid. I think that's the last of them. The gold is in safe hands. We did a good job today. May this not be the end of our adventures together. No, let's not end this partnership just yet. We can only move forward from here. Good day. Your Highness. They are stubborn fellows, aren't they? Now, if you would be so kind as to excuse me. I've had quite a bit of excitement today and must think on it. Do come see me again. Dang. Okay. Halfway, th halfway through his stuff. Okay, I thought we were gonna finish the game uh, tonight, but obviously not. So, oh well.
Henry has an idea of what we'll tackle next. He is waiting for us at Southwark Station. Go ahead. I will join you there. Oh, do I not follow him? Okay. Is he just gonna meet us there? Okay. Well. That works. Uh oh. I'm afraid we have done too much. The British Company are trying to capture your train. Agnes, I hope she's all right. Poor Agnes. I'll see to this immediately. I can handle the rest from here. Catch up with your train. Mr. Bean should be headed for Whitechapel Station. Okay. I'll need to catch up by carriage. I should take the Maharaja's carriage. Working on it. We're working on it. So I left Jacob in charge of the train. Come on! And he's just fucking off. This bridge and access the train. I'm already on the train.
on. Let me try this back. If that helps any. I have had so much problems tonight. I swear to God. The game is just like, there's no way you killed all our people so quickly. And you're like, yes, believe me, I did. Oh, hi! What a catastrophe. The British Indies Company must not be very happy with how things are progressing. You could say that. That should keep him quiet for a while. Perhaps this is not the best time to bring up what I called you here for. I have another plan. I'm listening. It may sound mad, but I propose we steal Koinor Diamond. A piece of the royal jewels? Whatever for? Her Majesty may wear it. But it doesn't belong to her. It was a trophy, symbolizing the colonization of India, and it deserved to be returned home. It would be an extremely delicate mission, but I know you'd be more than capable of such a feat. I have already procured some information pertaining to the location of the Koinon. Come and find me when you've had a moment to think it over. Now, something we already know is that the Koinor was a piece of Eden. Uh, Arbaz Mir, um, Mr. Green's, Henry Green's father, uh, had a whole adventure involving that. And... Uh, he got rid of it, I think? I don't remember what happened to the Koinor at the end of Assassin's Creed Chronicles of India. Anyway.
We have eight minutes left to stream. We're gonna see if how much of this we can get done. Between now and then. You do me a good turn. And then maybe next week, hopefully next week, uh, it'll be the final the final episode of the main storyline. Because we still have the the DLC story to do, this DLC storyline to do. Um, But obviously, we're not getting there tonight. Much ado about drinking. I put my ear to the ground and found someone who may know the location of the Koinor Diamond. Excellent. Heist my favorite. A man by the name of Cornelius Toti Button. Be a drinker. What? Can tell. He is apparently a friend of the royal jeweler. How will we find him? He frequents a pub in the city of London Borough called the George. Sounds like the sort of man I know how to deal with. Don't be ridiculous. Fret not, dearest sister. I will take care of this one on my own. Come find me in Westminster when you have the information we need. Royal jeweler this evening. It's a shame to drink alone. Whatever it is you want from me, I'm not interested. What I am interested in is ordering another pint. I'll tell you what. If I can outdrink you, you no, tell I mean, me where the famous Kohinoor diamond is located. <laughs> you think you can drink me under the table? That's a lot to wager on a losing battle. I'll take that as an accepted challenge then. Barkeep, two pints over here. Next morning, around 10 a.m. Oh, Jacob. You useless sod. Boy, my God. What happened last night? Well, I'll never make it back to the train in this state. I'll have to try to remember what happened. I know I was at a pub, but which one? Dead person. Dead person. Ah, you survived the night, I see. I wasn't sure what would become of you. <laughs> Hello. Oh, Dickens. of you when you sauntered off to that shooting competition shooting competition the name of the game is shoot the bottle precisely can you do it can you tell me where the diamond is you have to beat me at this first <clears throat> Only when the target is highlighted. I'm holding the button to aim. Next pint's on me. <laughs> <coughs> Are you 
drunk or something. I needed a pretty good shot. Can't hold your liquor as well as you thought. You're a good shot. Better than I ever would have guessed. Pardon. Or something. The next pint's on me. You're a good shot. Better than I ever would have guessed. We're done with this pub, but not done for the night. Onto the bricklayer's arms with you, Johnny boy. Follow me. It's Jacob. I can see why they made you play as Jacob for this mission. Never mind, Cornelius. Just tell me where the diamond is. Someone spilled it. Some bastard spilled my beer. Listen. Beer. Fine. I'll find the fool that did this. That was a near thing. Our game. Hey, Dickens. Good old Charlie. Let me talk to him. By Jove, spill someone's drink. Why would I ever do such a nasty thing? One for the books, or so I heard. Lots of sweat, blood, and tears last night. Those blighters can put on quite a show. Walk away with full pockets from those games they do. Sour punch, dwindling in number, but absolute terrors in this particular neighborhood. Beers all over the floor, and several people seem to have stepped in it. Maybe there's a, there's a, there's a lead somewhere in those trails. Oh, oh no, that actually makes sense. I was thinking they were being a bit goofy because he's drunk. The pettiest thing someone can do, if you ask me. You have to have one ugly personality to do that, you do. Last night's game. Why I won that fair and square. If Cornelius is still going on about that, he deserves a kick in the mouth. His money is mine and there's nothing he can do about it. You don't say. I think the guy spilled his own drink. Accidentally, of course, was drunk. You've got the wrong man. I haven't played a game of cards in the dog's age. <laughs> well, what about him? I hate those bastards. They love to terrorize me. You need to do something about them. I was talking to that yarn spinning oaf, Dickens, when I turned back to my drink, and it's all over the place. I bet you good money those evil blighters did this. No, I bet you fucking did it, my guy. <laughs> Drops of beer. And then he came here, picked me up. Came all the way back.
Yeah, dude, you spilled your own beer. You think I spilled my own beer? Ludicrous! Wait, well, maybe I did. He did. He did. Better get out of here before they start asking for more. Whatever shall I do? What in the hell? Uh, how was the beer? I think now, wasn't it? Uh, I think I'm gonna be sick. None of that now. Come, let's get you home. I don't think I can stand. You must be joking. Dude, you mean to merge with the scenery? He's so drunk, he merged with Mr. the scenery. Glad you're still with us. Okay, where are we going, my guy? Can't exactly escort you if you're not. What the hell? Sir, we gotta go. What are you doing? I think he's glitched. Fucking hell, man. I've had more troubles with this game tonight than I have the entire Assassin's Creed series up to this point. <sighs> Come on. Oh, that was a bit frightening now, wasn't it? There we go. I think I'm gonna be sick. None of that now. Come, let's get you home. I don't think I can stand that. You must be joking. Yay, he didn't glitch. Your purse, drunkard! Give up your purse! Help me! What did I do to deserve this? Cornelius, I need you to move your head, my friend. Oh, Joseph. I'm sure. I'm so glad to have a friend to join me. Right, He's Jacob, not Joseph. You're the nitwit from the pub. Let's make them sorry for poking their nose in the wrong place. <laughs> Still talking. This 
This is my place. You're a good drinker, you know. You might be better than me. I am. And never you forget it. Good night, then. Julia. But wait. All that, and he didn't get the information about the Koei Noor. Jacob, you are useless. At least I know where to find him. I don't need to move. Where is that button fool? Uh oh. What? Get back here, rat! Oh, he's snoring. Oh boy. Ow. How did you get up here? I walked you home. Jacob? Finally. Now tell me. Where is the bloody diamond? Does this technically count as winning? All right, all right. It's in the Tower of London. Surprise! Being held there until tonight's gala finishes, and then it will be shipped back to the Royal Jeweler for another cutting. Many thanks. Buttons. Now hold on right there. Oy vey. Okay. Ugh. Well, that was quite useless and pointless. Um. All right. Well, we're gonna call it there. I apologize. I really wish we hadn't had so many technical difficulties. Because we would have gotten so much further, maybe even completed the thing. But <sighs> I really do think we'll be able to complete it next week. Um, I hope. And so that the week after that, we can start. Uh, fuck, I forget the name of it. Doesn't matter. Start the DLC. And then we'll be on to Assassin's Creed Origins after we complete the DLC. But that's still a bit off. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, that's it for the night. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for spending the time and all of that. Um, we'll be back tomorrow with more Tomb Raider Tuesday. Uh, feel free to check out these amazing... These amazing. Uh, the links in my link tree. You'll find links to my socials, my Discord, my YouTube, my Twitch, all that stuff. Um, you'll also find links to recommendations of mine and stuff like that for like other streamers you could follow and stuff. Like Yvonne B, who's right back over my shoulder. Um, but, uh, yeah, um, that's it for me for the night. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Um, and I'll see you all next time. And until then, remember to have empathy, be kind, be safe, love yourselves, love everyone around you, and we'll see you tomorrow. I love you all. Peace out.